Uh, so I actually have an event today, tonight, and I'm going to show you how I'm going to do my hair makeup. How about that? It's going to keep it simple. And I'm in no means a makeup artist, so don't get horrified by how bad I blend. So first on my skin, I'm going to start with this one. At the organic pharmacy and it's like a gel tonifying rose and myrtle it's like all organic and it's for dehydrated and sensitive skin so I'm just gonna put a few pumps then I'm gonna put this Advent sickle, sickle fat uh, cream my skin is very sensitive this one really helps it Body. So I'm going to do a mix of the Armani Silk Foundation, the number 9 and number 8 because I'm a bit too dark for 8 and a bit too light for 9 so I'm just going to mix it and you know what, I, I do everything with my hands I know I shouldn't but well I always like to warm up my face because it's always wider than my body and my body is really tan. Some concealer and this one is a high precision retouch. High precision retouch from Armani. <laughs> Open it. And I like to put it on my hand and then just dab. I like to keep the concealer the same color as my skin. I know some people like to go lighter on the concealer. I don't. Let's go for the eyes. I'm actually obsessed with these two colors together. They're the new eye tints, and this is number 8, which I put first, and this is number 22, which I put second. So, I'll do the same. I put it on my, on my hand. They're very liquid, so you kind of have to be careful not to put too much. And again, I put it with my hand. Very light though. Hope you can see. But I like to put on top the number 22, which is kind of like a, a brownish. And this is the one you actually have to be careful putting on because it's kind of strong. And I kind of just want a little bit of a shade. I know you guys probably gonna like, oh, that's, she doesn't even know how to blend. Well, I don't, I'm not a makeup artist. Usually people do this to me, so. <laughs> now, just to define the eye a little bit, I just took this uh, eyebrow maestro. It's just black. So I dab a little bit. And again, I go on my hand to take the excess because I just want literally like the corner of my eye. It kind of makes the lash look thicker than it is. And curling time. From mascara, I'm really, really, really obsessed with the Classico by Armani. It's just ice to kill one. And I just love because I hate clumsy, like, uh, it's like clumsy, like uh, clumsy, I don't even know what the word is. Like uh, when it like, 
full of like clumps in your eye brush and eyelashes and I don't like that so I like them feathery and pretty. See the difference? Look at this mascara. It's like pretty amazing, right? It just makes it so feathery, which I love. Let's go to the brows. I actually lost my Armani brow pencil, so I'm just going to use something that I have here. I don't even know the brand, but I like to keep some natural, but I have gaps in my eyebrows because I pull on them. I don't like, I don't like them. They're like very drawn or anything. A little bit more to the eye actually so I'm gonna go back to that and see that I like to use this bronzer which is Sun Fabric Sheer Bronzer and it's number 400 so I just take, I'm finally using a brush. So I just take it and I was going to my neck because my neck is always super white. I love to look a little bit sun-kissed. Now, my favorite part is highlighting. Highlighting. I'm actually going to use two today. So I'm going to start with an A, a highlighter from Armani Neo Nude Collection. What I love, what I love about this one is just like it's just so easy to put on. You just dab, and then you just dab. It's just like so pretty. And I'm gonna put a little bit here. A little bit here. I'm gonna use this fluid sheer from Giorgio Armani and I like to use it as a highlighter. So I'm going to go to my other hand. So it's just very pretty. It's more on the pinkish side, which is what I'm going to go with today. And you just like tap. So I don't really like blush. I just don't. <laughs> so this is pretty much as for the skin and the lip. If I'm doing lipstick, I don't really do lip lining. I might go a bit darker. Sometimes it's fun to mix. Mm, I like this. So I put first the 102 and now I'm putting the 500. Oh, by the way, it's Rouge Dar Money Mart collection. Oh, powder. I almost forgot about powder because you never want to look shiny. I mean, you want to look shiny, but in the right places. So I just make sure I have right now the Luminous Seal Compact, Dual Use Powder Compact. Uh, this is actually number seven. So what I'm going to do is just I'm going to tap blow and just put a little bit I don't want it just enough to remove the the shine on the t-zone so I'm done with my makeup 